The theme of last night's costume ball at New York's Metropolitan Museum of Art was punk. And the A-listers who turned out from J-Lo to a newly blonde Anne Hathaway to Sarah Jessica Parker embraced it in a way that would have made Carrie Bradshaw proud. You can never go too big at the Met Ball, right? Well, I'm sure that there must be something bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Threatening to steal the spotlight from that headpiece, the newly public couple Lindsey Vaughn and Tiger Woods, who turned heads to the red carpet. Only 700 invitations were sent out to this event. It is a who's who of the fashion world. I mean, look, it's Madonna. Madonna donned a Givenchy ensemble for the ball. Tell us your secrets, because, girl, you yes. are good. Um, choose your underwear well. <laughs> Which? You have to dress from the bottom up. Nicole Richie colored her hair for the occasion. Miley Cyrus spiked hers. And famed designer Vera Wang and Scandal star Kerry Washington streaked theirs. Kerry, I see some like purple hues in your yeah, hair. Yeah, we did. We yes. might have a little color in here. A little green, green and a little purple. She has Beyonce. The honorary chair of the soiree, Beyonce, stunned in a Givenchy gown paired with boots. Are the boots comfortable though? They are actually. No. Are you... Also causing heads to turn, soon to be first time parents Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. The couple joined Tom Brady and Giselle Boonchin as one of the evening's most photographed twosomes. Looking less punk and more feminine were Katie Holmes, who sported Calvin Klein, and Heidi Klum. Revelers sipped champagne and took in the Mets' new punk exhibit, an homage to irreverent t-shirts, safety pin dresses, and ripped fishnets. Not a bad way to spend a night in the clothing capital of the world. For Good Morning America, Rachel Smith, ABC News, New York. And we have more sizzling looks, plus Brooklyn Decker's exclusive fashion diary, all on GoodMorningAmerica.com on Yahoo.